Rigsby, Fit Yummy Mummy and author of Intervals from Moms.com. Here to show you a fun way to fire up your interval training workouts. Because it's the 4th of July holiday, I'd like to use the theme of red, white, and blue. Let's do a recap on what interval training is all about so you understand how to use this 4th of July theme to get even more out of your interval training workouts. First of all, interval training is superior to any other form of cardio because it increases the metabolic effect, which means you're burning more fat and calories 24-7, and it reduces much more fat in the belly area. And the best thing about interval training, the thing I love the most, is that it cuts the time that you're doing cardio in half, if not more. It takes a mere 15 minutes to do an interval training workout. Now, interval training is effective because you are alternating bursts of work followed by short periods of rests. So I'm going to be showing you how to take this red, white, and blue theme by following along with one of my interval training soundtracks that you can find on intervalsformoms.com, which is on special this weekend only to celebrate the 4th of July holiday weekend. Let me show you what this is all about. One of the best tips to get the most effective interval training workout is to follow it along to a soundtrack because then you don't have to be distracted with a clock watching the time knowing when to start and stop the soundtrack does it all for you so it takes that part of the thinking out of it so you can turn that focus and that energy into the actual interval training workout now what I'm going to do I've, I've queued up a 30-30 soundtrack which means I'm working for 30 seconds taking a break for 30 seconds I'm going to be alternating between two different work exercises and the two moves I've chosen are jump rope, and if you don't have a jump rope, you can do pretend jump rope. And burpees, because burpees, you can do burpees no matter what your fitness level. So you can modify and adjust as needed to follow along. Now this is where I'm going to apply the red, white, and blue 4th of July theme. Because I have an interval soundtrack, for 30 seconds I'm working. And we know to get the most out of an interval training workout, we want to give our most during that work period. However, what I'm going to do is use the red as my cue during the first 30 seconds. So the first 15 seconds of that 30 second work period is going to be my red. Then when I hear halfway, I'm going to turn up that intensity and make it white hot by giving my all, giving my most, that, that push, that extra oomph of whatever exercise I'm doing, whether it's the jump rope or the burpees, for that final 15 seconds. So taking that 30 second block of work, getting it started, warming it up with the red, turning it white hot for that last half of that work period, then turning blue, taking a cool down, an active recovery, which could be just marching in place or just a light jog or light jumping jacks, up to you based on your fitness level. So when I hit play on the soundtrack, uh, you're going to be hearing the cues with the music and watching what I do to change it up by adding the red, white, and blue theme to get the most out of my interval training workout. Watch this. Get ready to move in three, two, one, go. So this is red, this is just moderate. When I hear halfway, I'm gonna turn up the intensity. jumping jack, you could do a light jog, whatever you want to do that's going to allow you to take an active rest. So we're going to keep that heart rate up. 10 seconds. Now I'm going to go into the burpees. Burpees are going to start off with red one of 15 rounds. and Begin the going next through round white. In three, two, one, go. So here's moderate. Bring it back down to blue. 
So that's a fun way to fire up the effectiveness of your interval training workouts because yes, we want to focus on intensity during those work periods. But sometimes, depending on the timed interval that you're following, you know, it can get hard to stay focused on that higher intensity. So if you kind of break it into two different blocks, a red and a white, and know that you're going to get yourself warmed up and during the last half of that work period, you're really going to give it your all, really push the intensity to an eight or nine or even a 10, because you know you have to do it for just a shorter period of time. Then that blue is bringing it down to that active rest. You can just march in place or do something more of a light cardio activity, whatever is going to allow you to truly get a break before you turn up that intensity again. I just showed you two rounds. For something like that, you're going, you're repeating those rounds so you complete 15 total minutes. Now remember, if you can go longer than 15 minutes for an interval training workout, you truly did not push yourself. Give this a try. If you would like to work alongside me and have the soundtracks telling you when to start and stop that halfway mark so you can apply that red, white, blue strategy, get intervals from moms.com. It's on sale for this holiday weekend. Here to turn up the intensity of your interval training workouts, burn more belly fat, achieve your fat loss, body shaping goals, and make it fun.